to another video yes already another tutorial now before i do go any further in this video make sure you do check my disco light and my self filling chest out if you want to do that uh if you don't know because in the disco it just sounds like decoration no it's as well as a command uh, tutorial so if you want to do that make sure you go check that out but in today's video we're going to be going over power-ups so without further ado let's get into it Woo! So, uh, I want to first show how it works. So, pretty much right here, right? Uh, it's just his info. So, you can just pick them up. Okay. Now, I use the self refilling chest in order to do this. But, um, you don't have to do this. I'm just using it because it looks kind of fancy. So, I'm going to grab three of them, of each. And then I'm going to show you this. This is the healing. So, this is, this is like, I'm still experimenting with this one. But the commands behind this is actually not that hard. It depends on how much you want. So, this is pretty much the command behind it. And, uh, yeah. So, as for instance, if I'm going to come over here and I drop it, sometimes you will get it. Now, it's not all the time. There you go. I got speed, jump boost, and strength. So, as you can tell. And this will, and then with the heal, which I thought this was really dope. Um, if I get myself really quickly a damage potion and then I put myself in survival and I you I drink this or something hits me with an instant potion or something I don't know you're really low this is when you pop the heal it will automatically always work and you see I got blindness you saw it you saw like a flight work up in the air and as you also saw I got instant heal pretty fast, okay? So I thought that was kind of pretty dope. Uh, as well, it has a side effect of blindness if you're going to use it. But I'm going to show off on how to do the power-ups for today. If I'm going to show you how to like add like all these cool things, like the summon command and crap, I will do that for this one, a different video, or it might be like a part two of that. Uh, but for right now, I'm just showing you guys on how to do this one. So without further ado, uh, let's get into the rest of the video. So in order to start off, you're going to want to find what item you want it. Now, you can use potions, but to make it cooler, you can use something else. So uh, I'm going to actually be using stained glass for this. So I'm going to be using this red, and this is going to represent a strength potion. So when I chop it, it'll turn into strength. So in order to do this, you're first going to want to get yourself a repeating command, okay? Place it on the ground like that. Open it and put the uh, redstone always active, and then come all the way up here. I like to just name my. Um, uh, I always like to name these, and then you're gonna type slash. Oh, no, 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 execute. So you're gonna type in execute, <coughs> and then space, and then at entity, and then you're gonna add these uh, like straight like straight uh whatever they're called i don't know what they're called okay leave me alone and now inside of them this is what you're gonna type you're gonna type in uh you're gonna do type i believe right oh let me just space that out type in type equals item so i i again i don't even ask what this does i'm just do the, just do this okay type equals item okay and then you're gonna do a comma and then you're gonna type in name and then I'm gonna press equal. Now this is when this becomes a little, not complicated, but this is when it comes up. So let's say, right, whatever is named that, it will work. Now if it's not named this, it won't work. So for instance, if I'm just gonna name this strength, 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 uh, no, we'll just say strength, okay? I'm gonna come back here. I'm gonna, and I like to do this. You don't have to do this, but you gotta be really careful if you're gonna add in. Uh, this symbol because if you if you do that it won't work okay you have to do a certain way so for right now I'm not gonna do a color I'll show how to do a color in a second okay uh and now you're gonna do space and then like the up arrow three times so you're gonna do one so this is what it should look like okay now you're gonna space them out and then you're gonna space again and this is where you're gonna type in another command so you can do like effect uh at p strength and then this is your second so I'm gonna do 100 seconds and you're only gonna get one of it okay and that's pretty much you done with that command so now when I drop this it's not gonna work because it's not named strength right uh, and I'll get to what these commands are doing in a second uh, why am I lagging Oof, that was crazy lagging where's an anvil when, when you need one right is there no anvil in here I'm too lazy to spawn an anvil okay guys just leave me alone uh, 
All right. So you're gonna place it down an anvil, and you're gonna name it strength. You have to say the exact word. If you mess it up, if it's lowercase, it won't work. Okay. So I'm gonna change that to strength. Ooh, no, 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 no. So like that. Okay. So I see it says strength. So now when I drop it. All right, guys, I'm back. So I had to fix it. I found out the fix for it. Um, it's because, well, see, when I typed it in, right, I had it perfectly, but I did a space, and what that does, it does affect it. It does affect it. So I have to delete the space, and then it will start to work, okay? Uh, and this is just a milk order. I'll show you how to do that if you want to know. No, I didn't do the kill. Oh, I did. Okay. Oh, it's gone now. But anyways, so as you see, it worked. I see, as I dropped it, it worked and yeah all right so now i'm gonna show you guys on how to make it where now again you're gonna do the same thing so you're gonna just do this place one on the top name it and then so forth do the same exact command from down there if you want to do another potion effect that gives you it so like a comb accommodation you know what i mean so you can do that yourself but i'm gonna show you now on how to get rid of the item so when you drop it on how it will uh as well disappear so let me quickly just grab my milk arrow drop that so uh in order to do this you're gonna want to um now you're not a creator timer so i usually use timers for a lot of these command block videos right you're gonna do exactly what i'm doing uh like that i like to set them at least like a varied it, it can vary i guess just okay like that that seems fair now you're gonna kind of go off into a distance and place this, and you're now you're gonna type slash kill oop, at e. Now I said okay, this works, but this also will kill the player, so you're not done. Now you're gonna add in the two right there, and you're gonna type that uh, name equals, and then type in the name of it. So again, my name is strength, right? As simple as that. So now it will now. Uh, disappear as you now know this can work with any item so once you actually already have the command set you can just do it with any item right uh, uh you could just do that so when I drop, drop it on the ground wait I forgot I have to activate it um, all right so that's activated now so it will now kill the items that are on the ground as you see it instantly disappeared and gave me strength and that's pretty much how you guys do it, guys. Uh, and if you guys want more, subscribe, like, and comment. And I might be doing another video today since we actually hit 157. If we hit 160, I'll do another video. Yeah, that kind of sounds fair, right? Without further ado, subscribe, like, and comment. And, yeah.